good evening. This is a known hangout after the bars close, but starting this weekend, that's going to change. This is a common ground for everybody to come out the rumors. Just before three early Wednesday morning, Lakeland police were trying to break up a large crowd at Salem's restaurant on Memorial Boulevard. As they approached a stolen black Camaro with guns drawn, they say the driver, 17 year old Michael Taylor, sped up, nearly hitting one of their officers. Three officers fired into the car. The teen died from his injuries. What we want to do is protect our community. Lakeland Police Chief Larry Giddens says it's been an ongoing issue. After the bars close, they come there, they gather. You have a mix of alcohol, then you have a mix of gunplay, arguing, fighting, and we're hoping to resolve that. Eight on your side has learned Lakeland Police have responded more than 200 times in the last year to Salem's where the deadly shooting took place. The chief says restaurant ownership is working with them to improve safety at the location. They're going to hire police officers as for security up there and we're going to turn it into after two o'clock a drive through that will not allow these crowds to gather there. This weekend the restaurant will close early at 2 a.m. After that on their busy nights, Wednesdays, Fridays and Saturdays, they will only have the drive through open after 2 a.m. The restaurant owner came out and talked to me. He said he wants people to know that his restaurant is safe. Unfortunately, he says they've been losing business. In Lakeland, Melissa Marino, News Channel 8.